1938 was an important year when we're talking about the lead up to the atrocities of the Holocaust and when we're talking about the Second World War in general. Um, if you look at the photo, it's a beautiful beach town. I think any of us looking at that photo out of context would think it looks like a great place to vacation. Um, and even in the photo, there are people swimming, there are people on the beach, there are people having a great time. It's in very, very stark contrast to what was happening in the town, which is called Evian Bain in France. In 1938, there was an undeniable refugee crisis that was starting. Um, contrary to what many people may think, the Holocaust, the lead up to the Holocaust really started with Adolf Hitler and his men saying, we just want Jewish people gone. We want them out. There was a short period of time before the final solution was implemented where the only thing that they cared about was they weren't in Germany. And this led to a large number of Jewish refugees who obviously needed a place to go. So while all of this is happening, the 32 countries who ultimately met at this conference began to realize that they could no longer deny the refugee crisis that was happening. So they all came together in this lovely seaside resort town. Um, many of them sent representatives. The US President Roosevelt um, didn't attend. He sent a representative in his place. All of these representatives stood up and said how sympathetic they were and how bad they felt that this was all happening. And yet of those 32, only one country accepted any refugees. And even those refugees were a tiny percentile of the number of people who were seeking refuge. So aside from the Dominican Republic, all of these countries, despite coming together, despite traveling all the way to France to talk about this, did nothing. And a large number of the people who could have been helped if that conference had gone differently ended up perishing in the Holocaust. And so seeing this photo, to me, is a reminder of the luxury that some people had to forget that this was going on, to ignore the very obvious facts that something was happening and that something awful was about to happen.